Two boulder climbers traveled to the North Pole using only skis and snowshoes. Well, now they have turned their trek into a documentary set to air this Wednesday. CBS 4's Mark Taylor tells us why this trip may be the last of its kind. Because it's going to get a little chilly. It's a roughly 500 mile trip across a frozen ocean with temperatures 60 below freezing, just one mistake away from a watery grave. Why did you do it? <laughs> but standing on the North Pole was a longtime goal of Boulder yeah, adventurer nice Ryan Waters. His colleague Eric Larson had been twice before, and in early 2014, the pair set out to achieve Water's dream. It's a very small community of people that have ever done that. But they soon realized the trip may be the last of its kind. The ice this year is so different from what I've experienced in the past. The amount of open water is, just keeps getting bigger. Their journey is now chronicled in a two-hour documentary on Animal Planet called Melting, the last race to the pole. You see suffering, you see laughing, you see crying, you see polar bears. Waters says from skis to snowshoes to swimming, the pair used every method they could to reach their floating destination. Just standing on a pan of ice, we could see, looking at our GPS, that we are actually moving south. And while Waters says this documentary will add to the climate change conversation, he hopes viewers take away from it a look at a desolate but beautiful place, one where few have been, but many should care about. We're just another avenue for people to see that location and see what kind of changes are happening. Mark Taylor, CBS 4 News. Incredible. West End Tafford in downtown Boulder will host a viewing party for the premiere, which is this Wednesday night at 7 o'clock.